All right, somebody asked uh, to show them how I do floor 98. So I'm going to show you. This person actually has my my gun. Let's see how much time do we have. We have two minutes on this. I'm going to go ahead and tempt them. Though I really, honestly, I don't think I need them, but, but hey might as well alright um okay so this is th this floor is kinda stupid to be honest it's kinda hard to dodge if you get grabbed here let's see if we can dodge oh my god we were actually able to dodge that? no way alright so what you wanna do is for those who don't who freak out or panic at the beginning you wanna come all the way back here if, if you panic if, you, if you're one of those people that are like worried to, to get grabbed or something like that you want to do this so I am going to all right that should stop them from grabbing me to a certain extent nope all right so here's where you want to come but the thing is the thing is that if you are panicking when you come through these doors you're you're probably are gonna miss the jump and uh, yeah you're gonna miss the jump and then you're gonna get grabbed and you're probably gonna die and you don't want to do that so what you want to do is you want to kill everything that's close to this door because you have to open it okay or at least attempt to open it and I'll show you what I'm talking about in a second I'm just gonna kill all the zombies that are gonna be able to see me immediately I think I think we're good. Let's go ahead and go. I shouldn't I shouldn't be you know get grabbed. Let's go ahead and put an ammo box here. I'm just gonna put it right there. I'm gonna jump up here. Uh, you see it has the reload thing, so you want to go a little bit further up to where it says open, and then a bunch of zombies are gonna spawn, and then you want to do that right there. So we're gonna kill these because these are the ones that are tagged targeted. You can see uh, the the things on the map little targets in the map so those are the ones you want to kill first I do want to point out that this person is a uh, rifleman so yeah give me just a second I don't even know okay I, I gotta kill this one for sure alright so you can use uh, what do you call it you can use a T hormone right now I'm using uh, nothing but sedatives because you'll see why honestly honestly you don't need if you if you have the firepower if your stock and your attachments are pretty high I mean you don't have to use a T hormone but it's completely up to you obviously another thing about having the ammo box there is that you can reload like that right there okay um we're gonna get closer to these guys so we're gonna go here this is one of the tr trickiest jump jumps that you're gonna be making so you want to be careful with that make sure that there's no zombies around if you're not comfortable making that jump because you will be you're gonna get knocked down for sure okay so I gotta kill these okay that's it and now we gotta kill these Alright, so we're gonna open this. Um, you know what? We're gonna put the other ammo box here. I don't think. Can I? I don't know if I can make this jump. Actually, yeah, I can totally make that jump if I need it. But I don't know. So I'm gonna throw a sedative down, open this door, and as soon as you open it, you wanna take a step back.
throw a sedative here because they're going to try to rush you and you want to be able to kill them before they get to you. I'm gonna put down an ammo box here. I don't think we're gonna need it, but I'm gonna pick this up. And as soon as I come here, we're gonna get zombies. So you wanna throw a sedative here. That's how you pass 98. Alright guys, if you like the video, make sure you leave a big thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't done so already. And I will catch y'all later. Peace.